to another video. I hope you had a really, really brilliant Christmas. I hope you all got spoiled rotten. And also, I hope you spent a lot of time with your family because that's the main part of Christmas. I absolutely love Christmas. The main part is spending time with my family and obviously this year is my daughter's first Christmas so it was even more exciting for me and she got very spoiled. I will be doing what my daughter got for Christmas as another video so do keep your eye out for that so that should be my next video. But today's video is what I got for Christmas. Um, I got a lot of things, I was spoiled by my boyfriend. Um, I'm not bragging in any way, I know everybody says this in all their videos. I'm really, you guys wanted to see this, so I don't see why people should have to say that, but yeah, I'm just going to show you what I got for Christmas. If I feel a bit, if I sound a bit like low, or if I sound like not myself, I have a really bad headache and I've had it all day. Um, and I just can't get rid of it, so I think it might be turning into a migraine. But apart from that, I'm just going to get into sh show you what I have. Sorry, I can't speak. I'm going to do it in a random order. I will tell you who they're off. Um, but apart from that, let's get in with it. So the first thing I'm going to show you is on my finger, because I've already got it. I have this ring from my daughter, Gabriella. Now, I did have another ring to start off with, if you saw my... Instagram post if you have me on my personal account um, but I will pop in a picture here if I still have a picture of it um, or I'll pop in like the picture of it how it was from the shop um, but it didn't fit me my partner actually got the wrong size so we had to go in and change it um, and I picked this one instead because this is the only one they had they had this one and another one but I didn't like the other one so I went with this one I had this box full of makeup now this is off my boyfriend and Gabriella because I've put the bits that my boyfriend got me in this box as well um, and I'm so grateful for all these presents like as I said I don't really like care about the presents on Christmas I'd rather spend time with my family but everybody buys me presents and I'm really really grateful for them and I'm sure everybody else is grateful for their presents on Christmas Day so yeah so the first thing I got was this NYX London set I am in love with this set, like I've used most of this makeup Christmas day to do my makeup for Christmas, I'll put a picture here how my makeup was for you, um, and I use the eyeshadows in here and they are so pigmented and I made a stunning look with them. If you would like that look, for me to make that look for you on a video, then comment it down below for you. But this is the NYX London Lip Iron Face Collection. So it comes with a big mirror, which I don't want to show you, but it comes like this. Now I used, what does I use? This like mauvey pinky colour and this really like dark purpley colour. Like I used the, that um, in my crease and then that on my corner. And then I added a little bit of silver as the base, like the main colour. So you get four eyeshadows, you get this, this. So this mauvey colour, this like pink colour, this purple colour and this like shimmery black. You also get a highlighter and you also get a blush. Along with that, which I was so excited about because I've always wanted to try these and I like £6 just for one. I got the NYX Lip Soft Matte Cream and I believe this is in London. <laughs> so I got one of those. I haven't tried the cream out yet but I will do soon. So that's that. And that was off my boyfriend. This thing off my boyfriend is this foundation. Um, this is the Rimmel London Lasting Finish 24 Hour Breathable. It has this has SPF 20, and this is 10 light porcelain. Um, all my foundations that I've currently got in my collection, they like they make my skin go weird. Like you can see my dry skin and stuff, and it's really horrible. But I tried this one, and it's absolutely perfect for my skin. My boyfriend absolutely loves it, and he said for the price of it, he's willing to buy buy it for me all the time when I run out. This foundation, if you didn't know, has been raved about so much at the moment, and it comes with one of those big sponge things. It's absolutely amazing, this foundation. I absolutely love it. I can guarantee you I'm going to be buying this foundation all the time if they don't discontinue it, because if they do, I would be very, very upset. But it's amazing. It's actually better than the actual lasting finish 24 hour, 5 hours, just the normal one, because it, it's breathable. Your skin's not like 
feeling heavy or anything. It, it feels moisturised and stuff like that. So I got that off my boyfriend. Off my daughter, this came in like a pack of three, but I've obviously said I've used them, so I've chucked like the packaging away. But I got three of these MAC lipsticks. Now I know they do a new set of these because I've seen them. Um, and I did actually pick these myself for my daughter. Um, but I seen them and I did pick them up at the time and then when I went back to get them for my Christ part of my Christmas present, um, they were gone. So I just went for the reds because I don't have many reds in my collection anyway and I have loads of nudes so it wouldn't really matter. So it come, these are the NYX Turned Up Lipsticks. I wore this red colour for Christmas as you would have seen on the picture. This one is uh, Hollywood. This is a beautiful light red colour. Um, this one is Wine and Dine. Let me take the lid off. This one is a really dark wineish colour. Really beautiful. And then we have this one, which is Dahlia, I think. And this is like a really like browny, reddy, blacky colour. If that's how I can explain it. I will add swatches in the video for you. Next thing I got for my daughter is the NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Powder Foundation. Now I don't use it as a pan foundation, I actually use it as a powder to set my makeup. This is in Nude Beige. As you can tell I got a lot of NYX makeup because I have never tried NYX makeup before. Um, this comes with a mirror, this is what it looks like. It looks very orange, but trust me, once you put it on your face, it looks really, really nice. And then it also comes with one of those sponges. And this sponge feels really, really good, actually. But I'm not going to use that sponge because I use it with a brush just to set my foundation. So, yeah, I got that off my daughter. Off my boyfriend, I got this Bourjois Paris Oula Velvet Lip Kit. And this is Don't Pink of It. So this is just a one of their... Um, Rouge Edition Velvet and their one of their lip contours. I actually wore this yesterday as well because I was fed up with the red. I wore the red all day for Christmas and then we came home and then we was going to go to see my best friend um, and her son and her partner because we haven't seen them in a while. So I put this on instead because I still have my makeup on and I just wiped my lip off and put this on. So you get one of their sticks like this and you also get a lip liner which I think is really good now basically what I did with my boyfriend he struggles to get me presents like he never knows what to get me so one day I went round and showed him what I wanted and what I liked so we took pictures of him on his phone and then the Saturday after him and my best friend's partner they went out Christmas shopping for me and my best friend um, and then they actually made me and my best friend wrap each other's presents so all they could have known we could have told each other what we got but we didn't next I got this now I know this is always raved about and I've always wanted to try it and plus I haven't got a good contour kit I've got the essence um, contour kit where it's got three bronzers like one's shimmery one's really shimmery and the one's just matte and the matte one does nothing like it's so light you can't see it on my skin so I asked for this for Christmas and it smells of chocolate, as it says on here. But this is Bourjois Paris um, bronzing powder filled with glitz for sunshine. And it's their chocolate one and this is in number 52. This stuff is bloody brilliant and it smells amazing. It doesn't actually smell of chocolate, like it's not a strong chocolate scent. It actually smells of a different sweet. And I can't think what sweet it is. But it smells lovely anyway, and I love that present, and that was off my partner. Everything else I'm going to show you in this little box is off my daughter. So the first thing I got is the Elegant Touch Express 3 Minute Manicure, no mess, no stress, no glue. Um, and these are like paint splattered ones. I hope you can see that. And they're really really beautiful I like these because they're really really short and having my daughter I can never wear false nails like I want to anymore but having stuff like these because they're so short I can wear them so I love these and I don't actually use the sticky bits that are in them I actually use actual nail glue because I like them to stay on longer so I got those of her I've used this so sorry if this is disgusting um, 
when I seen this, I was really shocked. This is the Makeup Gallery, which is Pamland, and this is their brush. And it works exactly the same as all the expensive brushes, like the Aristan Anastasia Beverly Hills one, sorry, and the other ones. I know you can get the set off eBay cheap, but I just wanted a small one for the moment, just to do my concealer and my eyes and that, because I don't have a brush small enough for that. And this brush blends stuff out perfectly. Now it's a bit flimsy, I don't know if it's meant to be like that, and the bristles, I had a few come out when I was, um, when I first opened it, but now it's literally like dense as anything, it's a brilliant brush, so I hope how long I bring out the other sizes too, because I'd love one for my foundation and maybe my contour. They have bought the little thin ones out, I seen them in Poundland today when I went into town, um, they do the little thin ones for your nose, nose. I might pick that one up because I like, I want to try out nose contouring, but I got that off my daughter. Or if I'm blabbling, I'm just trying to explain myself a little bit. The next thing off my daughter is another NYX product, and this is their NYX HD Photogenic um, Studio Concealer Corrector. And this one's in the shade Alabaster. This is like a really, really, the lightest shade they did, apparently. Um, so, and it's brilliant. I put it underneath my eyes. It covered the bag straight away because I haven't been having much sleep with my daughter. Uh, but it covered the bag straight away. And then I put it on top of my foundation as well. And it brightened my eyes and it looked so nice with the foundation. Um, so I highly recommend this. It's my new favourite concealer. Along with the collection one. I don't know what that one's called. I then got this little sample of the Benefit Cabrow uh, colours, which I don't think any of these are going to be my shade, but this shade 3 and 4 in there. I might give shade 3 a go once I get my eyebrows like sorted. But yeah, I got that. I then got these two lip balms, which are limited edition, and this is the Mardi Gras lip balms from Collection. I got number two strawberry. Oh, that smells nice. I didn't realise these had a scent, but I got those. My lips are always dry, so I can see the reason why I got these, because <laughs> I'm always morning. And this one is green apple number one. Oh my goodness gracious me. Guys, if you can get your bloody hands on these, get the green apple one. Or at least just pull the lid off and smell it, because it smells amazing so i'm gonna give those a go when before i do like my makeup so that my lips are nice and moisturized i need i love a good lip balm now i believe this one was a freebie um but i got it as a present which i love because i love it when people got freebies i also got this as well this um this is not out in store yet till next year but this is the garnier skin active micellar water oil infused cleansing water I think loads of people got this, um, but I got this free as well. Um, but I got this as a present. I didn't get that as a present. Um, but it's the Cougar 24 hour lipstick. I got mine in Corker, which obviously, guys, is a lovely nude cut. It does come a of brown on it, but it is like a brownish nude. And that's really nice. I like that. Not too sure on the formula yet, but. I haven't tried it, but that's nice. I then have this Jordana Eyeshadow Gold Dust. I believe this is an American brand. Yeah, LA. Um, and this is just like a nice, like goldish eyeshadow, like a singlet eyeshadow. I love singlet eyeshadows because if you ever go out somewhere, you could always just pop singlet eyeshadow in your bag and you're ready to go. I then got this Revlon Nail Art French Mix. Um, so you get like the white and then the light pink. Um, have enough nail polish as it is, but I don't have colours like this. And sometimes um, I do like a light pink on my nails. Um, and this colour's in Miss Perfect, so that's pretty. Then I have this um, Ashtore lip liner pencil in 09 Blossom, and this is like a nudie pink colour. I think that will actually go, yeah. This will actually go with that lip kit I got. So if I ever run out that lip liner, I've got a spare one. Then I have this Jordana lip, lip lipstick. I was gonna say then lip liner, and this is in the colour classic bronze. Now 
I'm not too sure on TC Birth Swatch, but I think this one, if it is okay, it might go well with that Cougar lipstick. I know it's in bronze, but it might come out brown because it doesn't look shimmery on the stick, so and that's humongous, that's good. And then the last thing I got is the Olme Ideal Gloss. Now I don't wear much gloss, um, but this is 3-5 Wine Shimmer. Um, it's actually a nice red, and as I said, I don't have many reds in my collection. But it is a gloss, as I said, so I'm not too sure if I would wear it. But I probably will. I'll get. I'll try. I'm trying to get into glosses. I just don't like the way when they're really sticky, and they feel horrible. I hate it. That's that box empty anyway. Okay, so next I'm going to go into this bag of presents. I actually asked for this gift bag for Christmas because I love Disney princesses and I wanted to keep it as like a um, birthday bag for my daughter next year for her one year old birthday. Um, there is one thing I can't show you um, because I've actually put it in the wash because I wore it on Christmas day but it's a yellow t-shirt, I'll pop a photo of me wearing it here for you. Um, but yeah. So the first thing I got is this perfume from my brother Charlie. Um, and this is the Internal Magic, I believe this is by Avon, yeah. I haven't actually smelt this because I've only just found this in my bag and realised I didn't open it so it was still wrapped. <laughs> so we'll have a look together now. If I can get it out. So we have this really pretty bottle. It's like a purple perfume, let's give it a sniff. It's actually really nice. It's like, it's got a little bit of an old lady scent. I ain't gonna lie, I'm grateful for the presents as I did say everything. It does have that little old lady scent, but then it goes really sweet and floral. Like when you first spray it, it's that little old lady scent and then, which I love the smell of that. I think old ladies smell brilliant all the bloody time. But then it goes sweet and then floral. So that is really nice. And that would be like my emergency perfume, I think, if I ever like run out and I can't get to the shop. So I love that. And I always use my perfumes up anyway. I'm never ungrateful for anything. So I got that off my brother. So Charlie, if you're watching, thank you. I have this t-shirt. As I did say, I can't show you the other one. Um, and it's this tiger one. My mum actually got the same one. So we got matching t-shirts now. It's off the shoulder because I love my off the shoulder t-shirts and it's just this really long t-shirt with a tiger on it. So I got that off my mum for Christmas. I got this perfume. Now I picked this perfume out myself. Um, I saw Pharrell Williams on it and I do like his music and I was like oh my god they do Pharrell Williams in Poundland and I was saying to my mum can I please have this for Christmas off you? Not smelling the perfume and my mum says, go on, just throw it in the basket. I'll get it for you. It's only a pound. Um, it is a small bottle, so like a travel size bottle. I went to smell it the other day, and I do not like the smell of it. So I think I'm going to just give it to my mum, obviously, because she bought it. And she'll like the smell of it. So, again, it's got that little old lady scent to it. Not so strong, but I just don't like it. Because <laughs> um, it's got like a... It's a weird scent afterwards, like it goes, the smell goes weird afterwards. Um, so I'm going to pass that on to my mum. I know it was a Christmas present off her, but she'll understand if I tell her I just don't like the scent of it. Because I'm very fussy with scents. The next thing I got um, is off my best friend, her partner and her son. Um, which her son is only two weeks older than my daughter, which is <laughs> weird because she's my best friend. And she had a baby two weeks before me. But this is just the Playboy Play It Lovely. Now my favourite one's the Playboy VIP. Um, but this one smells lovely. It smells absolutely beautiful. I absolutely love the smell of this one. So I think I'm going to spray some on. Very, very floral. But it also has a sweet hint. I think all my perfumes have that scent. <laughs> but yeah, I got that. So thank you very much, Joe, if you're watching this. Then, oh, my boyfriend, I got a Yankee candle. I've been wanting this Yankee candle since I first found out about them. This is my favorite scent. This is Pink Sands. It smells like watermelons to me. 
and my favourite scent is watermelon scented things. So I got this big jar. Um, this is their. I'm not too sure what gram it is. They normally have their 110 gram jar. This is their medium classic jar. So I got a Yankee candle from my boyfriend, from my partner, my fiance. If I keep saying my boyfriend, he's gonna cut my head off because we're actually engaged. So <laughs> from my fiance, I got this off. Then also off him, I got some sleek brushes. I wanted these so much, I kept nagging him every time we went into boots. Now this comes with a lovely little pot to put your brushes in. And it just says, I don't know if you can see that, indented sleek. You get a powder brush, which these brushes are so soft. There's no fallout of them or anything. There is some little sparse ones coming off the side, but I'm sure I can sort them out once I wash them. Um, so yeah, I got this one. It comes with a little contour brush, which is so dense and so precise, it's gonna be amazing. I do like my Real Techniques contour brush, but like, that's like a emergency backup one. Then I've got this one, which I think I would use for like, powdering under the eyes when you wanna bake or something, or like, maybe I'd use it for something. I'd use that for something. I've got so many brushes, I don't know what to do with them. And then it comes with this flat eyeshadow brush, which is amazing for packing on eyeshadow. And I don't actually have one like this, so I'm glad I got this one. And obviously then it comes with the beautiful tab, which you can take the pink thing inside out, put your brushes in, which is the main reason why I wanted this, and along with the powder brush, because I have a pot already, but it's overflowing, so I wanna put some of them brushes in here so that I've got um, a spare pot. And then the last two things in this bag are my Christmas cards, and this one's to my gorgeous fiance, obviously, off my partner. And then this one's to an amazing mum which is really, really pretty, and I love those. So thank you to everyone who got me presents out of that bag. I'm really, really grateful. So the next thing I'm gonna show you is something I didn't expect because it was a little expensive, but my boyfriend always buys me perfume anyway, and he just told me to pick a perfume that I liked. And I have been keeping my eye on this one since it's come out, because I love the smell of it. And this is the Ari by Ariana Grande perfume. Now first, I want to just say this box is beautiful. I will be keeping this box and storing things in it. I think I'm actually gonna use this as Gabriella's memory box um, because I'm making her a memory box of like all her little bits when she grows up and stuff so that she can keep it. Um, so I might just put something over the top of this here and just write her name on there and obviously then just cover the back of the box with something like photos or something of her. But anyway. It comes like this. I love the bottle because it has a pom pom on it. I'm obsessed with pom poms. Um, oh, and I got the pom pom bloody stuck in the bag. Thing. But you can actually unclip this pom pom off after you've finished. Let me just show you. If I can get it off. I don't know. I'll show you this way. You can actually unclip it off when the perfume's finished. And then after it is finished, I'm going to clip it onto my keys because I have a nice purple one on there. So it'll go nice with that. Um, but this is the bottle. It is freaking beautiful. As you can tell, I have been using it for the past two days. Um, but this is beautiful and it smells divine. Absolutely beautiful. I think this is my new fr favourite fragrance now. I also like the Nicki Minaj one. So I think for my birthday, because I'm 21 next year, next August, I know it's a long way away, I'm going to ask for this perfume and the Nicki Minaj perfume because they're absolutely divine. And afterwards, the Nicki Minaj perfumes you can actually keep because actually shaped as a body. And then also in here is a body lotion. I don't really use body lotions, but I think this one smells of her hand cream. I can't actually get it out at the moment, but it smells of her perfume, so I might use it as a hand cream. So I got that off my fiance, and I'm so grateful. Um, there was this one I picked, or there was a other perfume. I'm not too sure what that one's called, but that was like in a pink box. But he got me this one, because he said that's the only one they had left. The other one went out of stock so quick. The next present is off my best friend again, but this was for me and my partner. But I thought I'd show you in my video because obviously it was for me as well. But it's just this lovely like flower printed um, bedding, which is good because we don't have a spare bed, a bed it spare bed in to put on the bed after Christmas when we take all the Christmas decorations and that down. And this is in king because I do have a king size bed. 
um, and this comes with two duvet covers um, and four pillowcases. So it comes with two different designs. So it comes with this lace flower one, and then it comes with um, this like purpley line thing. I think this one's my favourite because I love this print. So yeah, I got two bed sets, which is really good. That's lovely. I didn't realise it was two until now. Um, but yeah, I got that off my best friend, so thank you for that. So we got some spare ones to put on our bed now. The next present is a jorky present of my mum. She always does everyone a jork present on Christmas Day because she likes having a laugh and stuff like that. My mother's crazy. Um, but I love her to pieces. She does spoil me rotten, I gotta say that. Um, and obviously, as you guys know, I recently, not long ago in September, I got my own flat. And I'm a little bit lazy with the dusting. Um, I just hate dusting. It's one of the worst things I hate doing. Um, it used to be washing up, but because since I've had my own flat, I've got used to that. Um, but I absolutely hate dusting my table that you're actually leaning on right now and my fireplace, and she bloody hates it. So, in this bag here, she bought me so Mr. Sheen Express Clean and Dust Smear Free Spring Meadow Spray and a dusting rag. So we all laughed at this when I opened this. I was like, really, mum, really? But I actually think she's trying to tell me to do my dusting. So I think I'm going to have to do my dusting before she next comes down or she's going to go crazy at me. But that's, we all get joke presents for Christmas anyway. Like my two brothers, they had odd socks. You can get these odd socks on Amazon, I'm not too sure what the heck they're about, but it's a box of socks, but they're all odd, so you can wear whatever sock you want. But because my brothers were always losing their socks, my mum got those as a joke gift for them both. Um, and they actually really liked them, they did complain about them, I, but I was like, why would you wear odd socks? So like, it's just jokey presents. I also got money off my brother, um, so I have some money. I haven't spent that yet though, it's still in my purse. But I also got this lovely sister card, which is lovely, so thank you for that. Next, oh, my daughter. My mother bought this off Gabriella. That's my daughter's name, by the way, if you didn't know. Um, and it's this beautiful little, like, oh, I can't even get it out of the box. This beautiful, like, little crystallised bracelet. Um, I'm actually going to keep that in its box because I have special occasions to go to. Like, next year I might be going to Romania and I might be christening my daughter up there, so I might wear that up there on the way up, so I've got it on me when she gets christened, but I've got that. Next in here is leaning on my bloody leg, so I'm gonna get it out of the way. My mum bought me this Technique set. Um, now, I used to wear Technique when I was a teenager, and I bloody still do love it. Um, so it's just a nice collection set. Um, I have a load of collection makeup now, so maybe I can do an all face makeup tutorial for you if you'd like, testing out technique makeup if you'd like. So inside, the few bits have fallen out if I can get them back in. There we go. Let me just take this bit off because you're not going to see the products. So it's a nice little case which I might store some of my um, nail polishes in. But as you can see, it comes with these two things here. Which you, these eyeshadows here, you can pop in them and then they've got travel cases. It comes with I believe two eyeliners, some little brushes, some lip liners, um, a metallic lip gloss, and another one in the corner, two nail polishes in each corner, and then a red lipstick and like a nude lipstick down there to go with the lip liners, which is really, really nice. So if, you, if you'd like a makeup tutorial on um, Technique makeup, let me know down below, but I got that case of my mum, so thank you, mommy. Going on to Technique makeup, my brother bought me this for Christmas, my younger brother. I've got the BC Brow Pencil with a brow pencil and a sharpener. I'm not too sure if it's gonna go on my eyebrows, it is a little bit dark, but it was nice of him to get me. Um, but I will try it on my eyebrows. If not, maybe I could use it as like an eyeliner or something. I'm not too sure if you can do that with eye pencils. Next in here, I have the Technique Eyeliner. This comes with a smudger as well. A nice long eyeliner. I was excited for this next product. This is the Pretty Makeup Cleanser. I can finally clean my brushes. I'm so excited for this. And this is just cleansing conditions, Synethic, Synethic is it? And natural makeup brushes. It just says pump a couple of sprays over the makeup brushes, ensuring the head of the brush 
is covered clean the bristles under a paper towel so that's going to be easier for me to clean my brushes and swivel them on they do need a proper clean they haven't been cleaned in months so i think i'll give them a proper clean and then when i start using them again and i need them to clean i can just start using that and i think that's leaked a bit because there's a little bit of water on it so i'll just have to keep an eye on that and it's a bit sticky <laughs> Next thing here, I have a Technique Matte Mineral Foundation in Sorel. I'm not too sure if this is my shade. Um, you will see in the swatch if it is or not. Um, but that's that. As I did say, I can do a testing technique make if you want because I've got everything apart from a blush, a highlighter, and a bronzer. But I can buy those myself if you do want to see the video. Then I have a Technique Get Lashed Mascara. And then a Technique with added vitamin E lipstick in the shade. If it has a sweaty shade. I don't think it does, but I think it's just this beautiful red shade, to be honest. Just this red shade, but a nice little lipstick. So I have plenty of products to test out. Like I said, if you do want to see a video, I can buy the last little bits that I need. Um, but yeah, I got that off my baby brother. Next in here, off my mum. I got this Avon Senses Moisturising Peaceful Reflux Orchard and Raspberry Shower Gel. It smells like Parma Violets to me, to be honest. So yeah, I got that. Off my dad, I got this purse. It's just a full brown leather purse. Um, it looks a bit like that. To be honest with you, I don't really use purses because I have my phone that has like an added wallet bit into it. But I'll keep it in case like that case ever breaks and I can't afford another one. Um, so I got that and that was lovely. The last thing in here which I got for Christmas off my mum. I'm obsessed with shortbread and she bought me my own shortbread as a little treat. So that is everything I got for Christmas guys. If you did your own what I got for Christmas video then let me know down below and I'll go and check it out because I love being nosy and seeing what people's got for Christmas. Hope you, as I did say, hope you all had a fantastic Christmas. Um, also, I hope you have a happy new year as well because we're coming to the new year now and I'm so excited. Um, if you did like this video, and I'm sorry that it's rushed, do give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, then hello, my name's Kylie. Do press that subscribe button because I love you to be part of my video. I will be more active in the new year. And if you didn't know, I do subscription box unboxings, testing makeup videos, which is new on my channel now, by the way. Um, and I do like shopping hauls when I do go shopping. I should have some coming soon, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, but yeah, do press that subscribe button. But anyway, guys, do look for future videos in the future. But until then, guys, I love you all very much. Thank you for supporting my channel. And I shall see you very soon. Bye.